Now at 11, breaking news. Sky Cal over the scene of a shooting involving a deputy. This is in East L.A. and Pomeroy Street near the El Tio Tono Market. Yeah, the Sheriff's Department just now telling us the deputies were called out here to the market on reports of a man who was disturbing customers. And when deputies arrived, they say they confronted a man holding a metal stick. And that's when the shooting happened. Sheriffs tell us no deputies were injured, but they are not giving us any details on the condition of the suspect. But in some video that we've seen from the air and from our crew there at the scene, the suspect appears to be dead on the sidewalk right in front of the market. And there are large crowds forming in the area. Deputies have set up a pretty large perimeter. Again, we do a crew there at the scene gathering more information. And as soon as that comes in, we'll give you an update. Welcome to KCAL News at 11 on CBS Los Angeles. I'm Tom Wade. And I'm Jasmine Beal. And for Leslie Marine tonight, we're also streaming on CBS News Los Angeles. All right, more breaking news to get to. Look at this, a violent flash mob brawl at the Pike Outlets in Long Beach. It was a massive scene there. What looked like nearly 100 people. I mean, you can see shoving, hitting, while dozens of officers attempted to stop the brawl and keep the peace. Po uh, police arrested an adult and a juvenile. Officers say that they were aware of this large gathering that was being planned on social media. It was a planned fight between two young women. In fact, businesses had already closed down early on word that something could happen. And then just around the corner from that, a shooting sent one juvenile to the hospital. No word on whether that's related to that flash mob, but police did increase patrols in the area tonight. We are just hours away from runners setting off in the LA Marathon, but before the excitement crews need to get ready for the increased foot traffic. Here we go. KCAL News reporter Lori Perez is in West Hollywood with the preparations that will keep things well running smoothly. We are here in West Hollywood along the Marathon route. There are signs like this one everywhere reminding people tomorrow some 25,000 runners will take over Sunset Boulevard headed west. It's an iconic event beloved by many and dreaded by others who live or work along the course. Mm. 